Um, this film is inspired by a very tragic event in Copenhagen in February 2015. Uh, the terror attack on first a freedom of speech meeting and then the Jewish synagogue uh, where uh, a Jewish guard got killed. At that night, uh, a newspaper called me um, and the journalist asked me how do I how I felt about uh, one of my friends uh, got killed in that attack. I didn't know that at that point. Uh, so I was shocked. It wasn't a, it wasn't a close friend. It, it was actually a friend that I hadn't seen for like 10, 15 years, but we worked together back then. That's why um, my name came up for the journalist. Um, this, it's, it's, this stayed with me. I mean, when, when terror, when terror, invades your life, um, it stays with you. So as time passed on, I decided I would, I wanted to tell the story. I wanted, I want to do something with it. Uh, so I decided to make a movie, this movie, it's called the powder keg in Danish. And, um, it's called the day we died in, uh, in English. Uh, it's called the powder keg because that's where the meeting of the freedom of speech meeting uh, took place where my former friend got killed and it called the day we died because this was when Denmark in more than one way lost its innocence. Before that, we were a small country that sort of felt safe. And, uh, even though we had the Mohammed drawings and we had a lot of controversy in the world with the Iraq war and the Afghan war, we still thought we were in the, we were right protected. But now we were a part of the uh, ISIS terror, international terror wave. Um, the film is about four men, all involved in the terror attack as either shooters or victims. One of the men was my former friend, called Finn Nagel, a freedom of speech activist. The other one is Dan Osan, the Jewish guard that got killed. The third one is the terrorist. The fifth, the fourth one is the uh, special force police cop that ended up killing the terrorist. So I wanted to make a movie where these four men circled around in their life on this very night and how unfair that is. And how we all have the opportunity and to affect each other's life in ways that we are not always aware about. Um, yeah, you know, I could talk and talk and, uh, you know, it's a difficult movie to talk about. So I have a suggestion. Why don't you go and watch the movie as at the Lubeck Film Festival? Then I promise I'll be there and we can talk more. My name is Ole Christian Madsen. I'm the director and writer of this movie. Thank you.